The ruler of Dubai, His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, has shared his vision to have solar panels installed on every single building in Dubai by 2030. UAE-based renewable energy firm Siraj Power has just completed this massive project, which proves that installing solar panels on residential buildings is not only possible on an in-scale basis, but is also financially viable. We are here with the CEO of Siraj Power, Laurent Longway, at the DP World Staff Accommodation in Jebel Ali. To start off, thank you so much for being willing to talk to us. It's a pleasure to be here. Yeah, it's a great honor and a pleasure to welcome you on this very special site for us. Wonderful. Laurent, could you talk to us about the magnitude of this project? Yeah, sure. This project is quite a large one. We are talking here about 7 megawatts of solar panels installed. So to do that, we have installed 17,500 of, uh, of these panels covering more than 100 buildings. It's wow. one of the largest sites in terms of number of the buildings in, uh, in the region. Wonderful. Could you also talk to us about the stages of construction? Yeah, sure. So for such a large project and the complexity of the number of buildings, we had to do a large, a long, relatively long preparation phase in the range of three to four months to make sure that we were getting all the permits, all the engineering and good, good process to be able to go fast in construction. The construction itself was approximately three months to cover all the, all the buildings. Right. What are the challenges you faced during the construction process and how did you overcome that? Yeah, so the challenges was the repetition. We had to do 100 buildings, 100 time permits, 100 time engineering. And that's where the fact that Siraj Power is an integrated player, meaning right. that we have all the, all the different skills in the company, the construction, the ONM, the engineering, it helped a lot. We put, the day we signed these projects, we put together all these people in the same room right. and we uh, have uh, thought all together about how to get permit fast, how to get the construction done, but how to get it done in a way as well that for the operation and mass maintenance team, it can be efficient and overall, we can produce a lot of electricity out of it. Laurent, the UAE has been talking about sustainability for a while now. How do all of these solar panels fit into that narrative? Uh, solar fits perfectly in that narrative, in the sense that when you produce electricity with solar, you don't use electricity produced by fossil fuels, so you offset CO2 right. directly. The CO2 emission offset every year on this site is approximately 7,500 tons. It's highly significant. It's like taking out of the road 1,500 cars. Okay. Or another example, it represents approximately the energy you need to charge 3 million mobile phones per day, which is approximately the number of mobile phones we have in Dubai. Wow. A lot of capital expenditure would have gone into this. Could you talk us through how this project is financially viable? Yeah, here we are talking about approximately 20 million dirhams investment. Wow. So for the client, we have structured it in a, in a form of a lease, which means that right from day one, they save on their electricity bill. Right. For us, indeed, we recoup our investment on a long-term basis, 22 years, and it takes time to, to recoup this investment. We have structured it in a manner that we can plug some debt, some bank helping to financing, right. uh, to financing us and making the project profitable. Thank you so much, Laurent, for talking to us. It was an absolute pleasure seeing your project. Thank you very much. And that's what a $5.4 million project looks like, comprising 17,500 solar modules across 110 buildings. You'll definitely get to see more such projects in future episodes of Construction Week Insight. But don't forget to share, like and subscribe below. Thanks for watching. That's all for now. Goodbye.